Don't give up, just don't give up. I'm living like that, I ain't lost my touch. Real one around, come on, start that bitch over. What's going on YouTube? My first pick of the day, complications. It gets your home screen an Apple Watch like feel with widgets you can interact with. You know, like you can change them. And they all live, so like this is the actual weather if I click on it. Uh if it worked. Let's see. Real weather. And also say you don't like the settings, like you don't like how I many rows or columns you got, you can change the rows or columns the offset and all that so yeah pretty cool tweak next tweak I got on my list smile Siri smile Siri oh, oh shit <laughs> smile Siri with smile Siri it gives you a mini Siri hey Siri go ahead nah, I don't want to talk to you Siri so yeah I forgot to add this in with my tweak with uh, smile Siri but with smile Siri if you say hey Siri Hey Siri, weather, weather, it's if you swipe clear. down you can see where Siri is talking Expect about, partly cloudy skies starting in the evening. that's what small Siri, I forgot to add that in there, yeah yeah yeah, hey Siri, lock my phone, I'd like to, but I cannot, my apologies, dang, Siri kind of rude today huh? So a car bridge, say your radio got CarPlay, you can use car bridge to add your own applications to CarPlay. So your radio will show whatever your phone show, or you can watch movies like MovieBox. That's what I use. You can watch movies while you're driving. That's car bridge, if you didn't know. And my next tweak of the day is passcode text. And with passcode text, you can change the password to whatever you want. So like I changed mine to go for it. Cause you know, go Q and go for it. But yeah. So with passcode text, you can have anything you want. Just change it right here. Like I'm gonna change mine to warning. I don't know. Something random. So let's try this. Oh damn. And let's see if we can do it out of respring. So let's try it. So yeah, you see? It says warning. <laughs> so yeah, that's passcode text. You can change your password word thingamajig to whatever you want. My next tweak of the week is Missile High Affinity. Missile High Affinity gets your phone like an equalizer. Wow. Missile High Affinity get your phone an equalizer on your music app, Spotify, and your lock screen. So like say. So this works on your Apple Music app, Spotify, and your lock screen. And say so you don't like the settings, you can go to the settings of Missile High Affinity, and you can change it for certain apps, your lock screen, notification center. It's top tweet, simple passcode. With simple passcode, you can hide the numbers and the passcode buttons. With simple passcode, you can choose to hide the letters or everything. I hid everything. But yeah, the choice is yours, pimp. The next app I'm running on my phone is WeVamp. With WeVamp, it plays certain music. Well, not certain music. It plays Wii music in certain apps. So like the weather app. If you go to photos, Play music and photos. This is the photo I have. Better focus. And you can choose, like, not what apps. Well, I think you can. You can choose what apps you want to play in. Or you can, well, not what apps. You get to choose the App Store, City, the Weather app, photos, news. So those are the apps you can use. But yeah, that's what we found. The next tweak on my list is Notepad. Notepad is really what it is. 
So with Notepad, you just unlock your phone. Well, not even unlock it. So say you're on the lock screen and you want to remind yourself something, you can just type your little note or whatever. And then you just hit done. And it stays on your phone. So like, you can just remind yourself to do something later or do something you need to do. You can change the size of the Notepad, but I got mine set for automatic. Cause I get a lot of notifications or whatnot. So yeah, that's Notepad for you. The last tweak on my tweak list is CC Linker. With CC Linker, it gives you like Android like, mm, Android like widgets in the control center. So with CC Linker, it gives you Android like widgets. Well, you know how Android is. We can hold and it'll take you to whatever app. I mean, whatever setting. Whenever you 3D touch. You want to scroll all the way down so, to the bottom and hit download. And then right here, that's where it get tricky at, you know what I'm saying? It get tricky. So you want to click on iOS download because you're on the iPhone. You click on that little Apple right there. And then hit download for free. Unless you, you know what I'm saying, got some money, you can get the pro version here, but I'm broke. So we're going to do this free version. You know what I'm saying? And then hit install. And then. Well, all this other BS website put the certificate and uh, verify it. You don't have to do that no more. But um, that'll be in the settings right here in general. And then you'll scroll down to profiles and it'll be right here. Normally, this would be it, but it ain't right there right now. So, yeah, I think they stopped doing it. But then we're just gonna wait, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't know, it'll take a little minute to load and install. So, I'm gonna go ahead and, you know. And we'll be back. You know what I'm saying?